All right, nice little potential support that form there at 79 half. Seriously, another bull bar? All right, long on the NASDAQ, looking for a target 93, a little bit closer actually. Target filled. Whoo! <laughs> go, 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 go! <laughs> um, so the reason I like the long, obviously I did not have a chance to explain that one beforehand. That was a, uh, one of the big reasons behind that was um, a, why am I drawing a blank on the word? Not a continuation play. It's a correlation play. There we go. Uh, correlation play. The Dow, the S&P, and the Russell all went ballistic to the upside. The NASDAQ's still negative. I already have a magnet sucking the NASDAQ up. Along with that, we just heavily moved to the upside off of a strong move down. Sellers are stuck. And when sellers are stuck and they try to come down really strong bear bar, I mean, look where this was right? Really strong bear bar, tons of resistance up here. That was a trap. It was only a first entry. Okay. You know, not a lot of sellers like being the first one to the party, especially with a strong move up like that. Strong bull bar up, another really strong follow through bear bar. That's a trap. Now they've got problems, <laughs> right? We have a second sell in a major zone of resistance that just shoved them right. I mean, it just slammed it right down their throat. And when they saw that bull bar and it just came two ticks away from their stop and backed off, there's no way they're going to hang out. They know they're screwed. So it's either they take a half size loss or a full size loss. Your choice, right? Everyone chose half size. <laughs> I helped them with the decision. <laughs> with a big grin on my face. <clears throat> You're welcome. 